A highly charged atmosphere here at Stamford Bridge, and you can understand why. Chelsea might fancy their chances, but their opponents are the formidable Manchester City. It's live next on EA TV. Stamford Bridge is the venue. I must say the weather has certainly cooperated. It's beautiful here today. My name is Derek Ray, and sitting next to me here on the commentary gantry is the former Arsenal and West Ham United midfield man, Stuart Robson. I'm looking forward to bringing you action from the Premier League coming right up. It is Chelsea facing Manchester City. Well, thanks, Derek, as always. The scene is set, two good teams, great playing surface, and a vibrant atmosphere. Has all the ingredients for a really exciting game. how it looks for Chelsea the Manchester City lineup. Ederson is the goalkeeper. Kevin De Bruyne plays with Rodri in central midfield and lining up through the middle in attack today, Erling Haaland. And the match begins. Well, they might be onto something, and nothing positive comes of it, unfortunately. He's enjoying space. They might be able to get in now. Well, nicely cut out. Ruben Dias. De Bruyne now. Rodri. Alvarez. Pass lacking precision. Too strong. Connor Gallagher. Di Sassi. Good tackle. It'll be a throw. Caicedo. Now, who can he play it to? And able to get a body in the way. Just can't get it past them. Well, he was in the right place to intercept. Early challenge of an illegal nature, and the referee can't ignore it. Well, there we have it, the first yellow card of the game. And he's going to have to be careful now. There's a long time to go here.
And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. And support available. But quick thinking defensively. Ake. Alvarez. Silva. Walker now. Kevin De Bruyne. They're certainly allowing their opponents to come on to them. Are they going to forge ahead? And that's an excellent piece of defending to thwart him. Enzo Fernandez. Chilwell. Extremely sloppy in possession. De Bruyne. Silva. Now potential danger. Oh, fine stop. They take it short. Bernardo Silva. Gonna get a try. Good pressure to win the ball back high up the pitch. And an attempt best forgotten, I think. An important interception. Well, it's been all City in the last 15 minutes or so and looked a real threat going forward. But they must take one of these chances while they're having this good period, but you do sense it's coming. Yes, who knows? Maybe another opportunity in the works for them. Oh, really commanding goalkeeping. Sterling. Getting in there to intercept. Ake. The ball with Rodri. Alvarez. De Bruyne. De Bruyne. Well, as you can see, this catches everybody by surprise. Look where he is when he strikes it. That's a great goal. So the ball rolling again with the scoreline standing at 1 0. Thiago Silva. Caicedo. Grealish. That's the kind of shielding play you expect from him. Terrific piece of anticipation. Sterling has it. Interception to snuff out the danger. Silva. De Bruyne now. Hanging on to the ball in this fashion suits them. So nearing the half-time interval and Chelsea facing a deficit. Stewart, what have you made of their first half performance? Well, they've not had quite enough purpose to their attacking play so far. It's all been a bit too predictable. But in the second half, if they can get more support to their strikers and play with greater intensity, they can certainly turn this around. Plenty of support here. Can he take advantage? Oh, that's a fine save. 
Not an attempt that will live long in the memory. Well, what a waste that is. It's far too easy for the keeper. Not a huge chunk of added time. One minute. Jackson on the ball. And reading it absolutely superbly. And the first 45 minutes have come and gone here at Stamford Bridge. Well, as complete a midfield player as you're likely to see, Kevin De Bruyne. Stuart, your assessment of his performance? Well, I thought he had a really effective first half. Not only did he get the goal that gave them the lead, but his general play was really good. He was a constant threat, and I'm sure we'll see more of him in the second half. Well, underway once more into the second half, and from a Chelsea point of view, it's all about battling back. This is Thiago Silva. Did well to win the ball back. Holland. Well, they must exercise caution standing off as they are. Rodri. But he keeps going. Walker. And options in the centre. And behind it goes the concession of a corner here. And a substitution in the offing. Short corner it is. Makes the move to the inside. Rodri. Oh, commanding goalkeeping. Kevin De Bruyne with the corner. It's always likely to be the goalkeeper's ball. He read the situation defensively and did his job. Great strong tackle, throw in forthcoming. So a half an hour remaining. Lukaku. Giving the ball to the opposition that time. Alvarez. The ball with Rodri. Vadiol. Mastery of the passing game. Alvarez. The Bruyne. Oh, terrific piece of goalkeeping. A change in the offing for City. It's a short one. Foden. Now with De Bruyne. Well, shielding the ball admirably. And no way through. And Chelsea get the decision from the referee.
Gallagher. And as they continue to pass it around, the attack goes through Lukaku. He's taken on his opponent here. Sterling. Lukaku. It's a perfect challenge. Into the final 20 minutes. Foden. Back to Holland. The referee has decided to give the free kick decision the way of City. Well, now he's walking on eggshells, you might say. Next time it'll be yellow. Substitution for Manchester City. And Manchester City will go to their bench. Number six, Nathan Ake. To be replaced by number five, John Stones. When all was said and done, Stuart, he wasn't a million miles away. No, he wasn't, because he generates so much power from that sort of distance. His technique is brilliant. Axel Di Sassi. This is Thiago Silva. But well, in the dying embers of the game here, and Chelsea still narrowly behind, time running out, Stuart. Well, they've certainly lacked a goal threat up to this point. There's been little invention, no real combination play around the box, and the crosses have been erratic. But there is still time to find that moment of inspiration. Walker. It is a decent looking attack here. Can he do it? Well, he makes the save and a good thing too. Well, what a save it is. But can they now go and get that equaliser? And time for the change now. Elects to go short. Foden. The ball with Rodri, and he read it superbly. De Bruyne. Here's Bernardo Silva. And that is how to block. Well, it's going to be a great finish here. These Chelsea fans are ramping up the noise now. They're surely going to get another chance before the end. A very good tackle. Well, there's still scope for late drama here. Five minutes left and just one goal between the sides. Both managers deciding this is the time to change things around. Both teams going to the bench. Phil Foden. Holland. On to De Bruyne. This attack looks highly promising. And let's give credit to the defending. Gallagher. Oh, skipping away. And the referee has deemed that an additional four minutes are in order. Who can he pick out? Defensive roadblock in the way of that cross. And this late corner could represent the last chance to equalise. Can he deliver it with accuracy? Well, no end product. The brain net. He could pick out a teammate. Another goal from this corner would in all likelihood secure a victory.
and played short. So the final whistle, and that's not how Chelsea fans were scripting it in their minds. A defeat. I wonder what you thought about their overall performance. Well, Derek, certainly not their best performance, was it? Just a little bit off the pace for me, and obviously a disappointing result. But the key thing is, they bounce back now, and they can't afford a repeat performance. Very much the organiser-in-chief, Kevin De Bruyne. What in particular did you see in this match from the talented Belgian? Well, I enjoyed watching him today. His work rate, skill and movement were excellent, and he fully deserved to score that winning goal.